Hi everyone, uh, I'm here for another episode of Showtime. This is a really easy way of getting up quite high. It's taken us 13 minutes to get here from Chesterfield and I've got some special guests for this episode. It's going to cost you £3.50 to park for uh, four hours and with me I have got Mr. Shaw, Mr. Shaw Mr. Omar Mr. and Mr. Andrews, Andrews. Jeff. Yes. Jeff and I here are, uh, we're in the squash leagues at Queen's Park in Chesterfield, just in the leagues, yeah, we've not been demoted yet. But uh, these fine gentlemen are visiting from Pakistan and they are in the uh, junior team. Uh, Shah is uh, the uh, under 19 junior champion. Yeah. Yeah, fantastic. And um, Omar is his, coach. is his coach. And also training partner. And training partner. So we're going to show him a bit of the Peak District. Are you excited guys? Yeah. yeah. Excellent, let's do this. Very kind Jeff, thank you. Just been listening to the bird life and we've heard a common chiff turf and a robin. What, around here? A few steps here to the start and then it uh, evens out a bit. Uh, I've just noticed Shah's got sandals. I think he'll still be all right, actually. He's a fit young lad. It's a little bit rocky. Certainly in the winter, you should probably wear boots. So after only five minutes, we reach a fork and we take it to the right and this is where there's a little bit of a scramble so just 10 minutes from the road and we're really up quite high okay we've got to the top got a little bit of a dab on and the lads are taking the mick a bit <laughs> they've hardly broke a sweat but they are world-class athletes i'd say why are you breathing so much <laughs> hey jeff How you doing? australia's finest guys much share like comment and subscribe to the channel <laughs> exactly that. Exactly that. You heard that here, guys. Okay, just coming up to the ships and the monument now. There's a couple of people here already. It is a fairly popular spot, but not as popular as, say, Kerber. From setting off from Brampton and getting up to the three ships and the monument, it's probably only taken 45 minutes. Okay, so this monument was erected in 1810 in tribute to Lord Nelson after the Battle of Trafalgar died in 1805 so it's erected five years later and behind me three rocks there are named after the ships from the battle of trafalgar there's victory Science, and royal sovereign 